oil and gas reserves are becoming harder to reach and the demand for modern drill ships is rapidly increasing. One company's foresight will see it christen four ships at once for the first time in its history. That company is Sea Drill. We used to be a small kit on rock, but we are the biggest company today. This is fantastic uh, to put these units into service. These four drill ships uh, really place Sea Drill at the forefront of the, the market. They are the most advanced drill yeah. ships in the world today. They really will set the standard in drilling. The ships have been constructed by Samsung Heavy Industries at their shipyard in Jeoje, South Korea. It's taken two and a half years to complete them, but they are the most advanced machines in the industry. These are an evolution of the rigs that we're already operating, uh, a little bit better technically, uh, more capability, deeper water depth. The biggest things about these ships are the hoisting and drilling capabilities. The, the drilling package is capable of hoisting over 1,250 tonnes, so these rigs are capable of setting world records in water depth. They are the, the best drill ships around and they will serve us for the next 15, 20 years. Sea Drill build their vessels to be cutting edge, and that's what sets them apart. The capabilities and safety features on these ships are second to none. These are 12,000 foot water depth capable units with uh, dual derricks on them that uh, are state of the art drilling machines. The other big technical change in these units is the implementation of dual BOPs. And that's come about since the incident in the Gulf of Mexico a few years ago. Cedrol is by far, you know, the company with a really a modern fleet and, and, and modern technology. So we're in a new, unique position as a company with the, the new assets we have. We've intentionally placed ourselves at this place in the market. We're at the front and we intend to stay at the front. And we have world-class technology, world-class equipment, world-class people. It's a leading operation. We have a young fleet already. Putting another four units into service just make our fleet younger. These units will be out there and they have a great future in front of them. With these four new state-of-the-art ships nearing completion, everyone is gearing up for the naming ceremony. This is really an exciting day. I'm here a day in advance of the actual naming ceremony and tomorrow we're going to have a big celebration. We'll actually go and name four rigs. There have been a lot of naming ceremonies in Cedral's history, and every one has uh, been special for one reason or another. But we have never named four ships at the same time. And for us to, to see how advanced these, these pieces of, of equipment are, and how well Cedril managed the process in building them, in this case four at a time, it's, it's, uh, it's amazing and also very reassuring. It's a very special event for, for Cedril, and uh, clearly it sort of shows that they are the leading uh, contractor in this business. Certainly capturing the market with a very new up-to-date fleet and uh, certainly a great prospect for insurers going forward. I've had the honour to be appointed to uh, be a sponsor lady of uh, West Saturn, which I'm looking very much forward to. You know, being a godmother is really, really a privilege and an honour and uh, I'm very, very excited for tomorrow's ceremony. The time has come. Lady sponsors and representatives of both Samsung and Seadrill gather at Samsung's shipyard to christen the ships. Three, two, one. The West Saturn, the West Neptune, the West Carina and the West Jupiter are now ready to be deployed. The performance they've done with the rigs that have been built here at Samsung, it's top notch. So we're very encouraged and we're excited to put them to work. As a shareholder in Seadrill, I always have extremely high expectations. Expectations were not only met, but they were exceeded. I've been offshore myself many years and uh, I'm a little bit jealous. I would actually like to, to take a rig out like that. That could be fun. <laughs> <laughs>